Google versus Microsoft locked in an AI race. And today, Google came out swinging. Google's all new Palm 2 is here, and you're not going to believe what this insane tool has got to offer. That's right, we've got a real showstopper for you today. Tools that you are building are going to cost people their jobs. The tools that we're building are here to help people. Whether you're at work or at home in your personal lives, it's to help you get more done. Google's Palm 2 is seemingly shaking up the medical industry. Is AI finally coming for our healthcare jobs? Stick to the end of the video to find out. Trust me, this is the video you won't want to miss. Sit tight, because things are about to go down. Let's go! The AI race just got hotter, and Google refuses to be left behind. All is fair in love and AI. Google has decided to up the game with its new and upgraded Palm 2, which is taking large language models to a whole new level. Essentially, Palm 2 is set to revolutionize how we interact with machines and take artificial intelligence to the next level. Let's take a look at what Google has announced and how its new AI child is set to shake up many industries. Introducing Palm 2 The industry has been buzzing with excitement since Google's announcement. Leading tech insiders have hailed Palm 2's capabilities for its potential to transform multiple sectors. And in this video, we'll see why the Palm 2 is all the rave right now. Palm 2 operates based on the transformer architecture and is pre-trained on a large corpus of text data. It leverages the strengths of the original Palm model and goes beyond that to incorporate improvements in the area of dynamic context and multitask learning. Now, I'm excited about Palm 2's features because Google has come up with something truly groundbreaking. In fact, I could say it blows ChatGPT and GPT-4 out of the water. But GPT-4 isn't finished yet. We still have many improvements coming, so we'll see how it holds up. But for now, let's check out Palm 2's features. Key features of the Palm 2 Multilingual Arguably the best feature, Palm 2 has been optimized to handle multiple languages. It is not a large language model for nothing, and we can see why Google named Palm 2 a state-of-the-art language model. It's truly remarkable. As a large language model, Palm 2 isn't just trained on a large text dataset, but more heavily on a multilingual text. Get this. The multilingual text spans over 100 languages. That's insane! This is something that many users have been crying out for, and now it's finally here. Palm 2 can perform language translations almost seamlessly, allowing for faster communication across different countries and cultures. I'm excited to see how this works out. It will significantly reduce language barriers. I can already see it doing wonders for tourists. Imagine putting in text in Spanish and getting Chinese as an output. Now that's something to look out for. Now, if you only think Palm 2 will only work wonders for text, Google says, hold my beer. We've got more coming. Palm 2 has new and improved reasoning. Improved reasoning. Thanks to Palm 2's wide range of datasets, it can now read and understand much more than just text or language. Palm 2's vast dataset also includes web pages that contain mathematical expressions as well as scientific papers. Thanks to this, it now has improved capabilities in mathematics, logic, reasoning, and common sense. I think the Palm 2 will shine well regarding research and education in general. I mean, there could be that one equation you can't seem to crack. Then comes the knight in shining armor, Google's Palm 2. Still talking about its reasoning, it's capable of understanding the underlying context of a sentence and providing a coherent response. This one's a giant combo of its improved reasoning and multilingualism. Palm 2 will be able to understand, generate, and translate nuanced text. I'm talking poems, riddles, and even idioms. This is quite similar to Cosmos 1, also a large language model that can understand jokes as we can see here. We can see that there's an image input asking to explain why the picture is funny, and Cosmos 1 explains that the cat is wearing a mask that gives it a smile. Of course, the image input signifies that Cosmos 1 is a multimodal large language model, but it understands jokes, which apparently the Palm 2 will be able to, seeing as both are large language models. Coding you didn't think Google would skip this now, did you? Of course, Google can't be left behind in the AI race, so it has built Palm 2 also to be able to code like new generation AI tools. <clears throat> OpenAI's GPT-4. Palm 2 excels at programming languages like JavaScript, R, Python, 
and that's not all. It can also generate specialized code in other languages like Verilog, Prolog, and Fortran. How is this possible? Google pre-trained Palm 2 on an incredibly vast amount of source code datasets. That's not all. Here, we can see Palm 2 with an input in English to fix a code and add Korean lines, which it does brilliantly. Fascinating! We'll have to wait and see how this works out. Now, remember I said that Palm 2 is shaking up the medical industry and is possibly coming for our healthcare jobs. I'm about to reveal the reason why. But before that, hit the like button to see more interesting updates like this. Now, what does this new tool mean for the industry? Say hello to MedPalm2, trained by Google's health research team with vast medical knowledge. According to Google, it's not just your regular AI medical assistant. MedPalm2 was the first large language model to perform at expert level on US medical licensing exam style questions. GPT-4 has aced professional exams, so I really want to see how it performs compared to MedPalm2 because this is another level of mind-blowing. Google has decided to add multimodal capabilities to understand better and analyze information like x-rays, CT scans, and mammograms. Do you know what this means? MedPalm 2 will be able to give 9 times more accurate results. You get reduced chances of incorrect diagnosis, which accounts for up to 251,000 deaths annually in the United States. MedPalm 2 significantly reducing this by 9 times is going to be a game changer for the medical industry. But then, does this mean we are in danger of being replaced by AI in the medical field? Well, there's always the need for a human professional with actual thoughts, emotions, and feelings. But the professional use of AI for better accuracy is always welcome. What do you think? Could AI potentially replace healthcare jobs? Share your thoughts in the comments! There's also SecPalm, another specialized version of Palm 2, specifically for cybersecurity, which uses AI to help analyze potentially malicious scripts. This will help to detect better potential threats to people and organizations. Well, what can I say? Google is pulling all the stops for this one. With all these crazy amazing features, it all boils down to whether we can access it. Let's find out. Palm 2's Accessibility Google unveiled Palm 2 at its I.O. Developer Conference in May 2023, but its release date remains unknown. However, it is assumed that Palm 2 is currently being tested and developed for use in a variety of applications. Google will be making the Palm 2 available in four sizes, which are the Gecko, the smallest, Otter, Bison, and Unicorn, the largest. The good news is that Gecko, the smallest is so lightweight that it can work on mobile devices and when offline. Developers may now access Palm 2 via the Google Palm API, Firebase, and Colab. The bad news is that Palm 2 is not yet available to the public as of now. However, it is expected that Google will make the software accessible to users soon. That's it for today's video. What are your thoughts on Google's Palm 2? Do you think it's leading the AI race? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Don't forget to share this video and subscribe to the channel for more exciting AI updates. Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, check out this one.